Youth Runner here with the Jaguars from uh, Flower Mound, Texas. Winners of the Bob Day Girls Sweepstakes race, uh, first ever for a Texas group uh, in the history of the Woodbridge Cross Country Classic presented by ASICS America. Uh, absolutely a fantastic effort, uh, great unity, great cohesiveness. Let's uh, talk to them about this uh, monumental uh, occasion. Introduce yourself, please. <laughs> I'm Michaela Kudak. Michaela, obviously, uh, you know th th this, this group has just been, uh, you know, so encouraging, so you know, so inspiring. Uh, but to be able to, you know, kind of take everything good that's happened already in Texas and now put it together, you know, in a, in a you know, in a simulation of what's going to be, you know, an NXN race. Like, uh, how 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 impactful is this for the group going back home? I think it's very, like, very impactful. It gives us a lot of confidence going into our next meets and everything. So I think it's very, it helps a lot. Fantastic. Congratulations. Hi, I'm Kira Primer. Kira, uh, just in, in terms of this group running to its strengths, running to its identity, right? Like, obviously, no program in the history of high school cross country is ever going to replace Natalie or Sam or Nicole or whatever. But the thing that I appreciate so much about this, and I told you know uh, the family cook, is that is that this group just runs to its strengths, run you know uh, you know runs you know, so well together and, and and moves together as a group. Like how important was that tonight, especially in such a big field? I think super important. I know that a lot of us look for each other during the races as like monuments to where we should be, and it's just I mean. We really do love each other, like as family, even outside of the race. And so, just racing with your family, it's such a good feeling. And it's just having people you love in the race is such a huge confidence booster. And it's it's the best feeling. It's so fun. Fantastic work. I'm Liana Cluley Garza. Liana, just in, in in terms of the group, just being able to stay so composed, right? Like so trusting in the training, so trusting in, in one another. You know, because you know. This is like a roller coaster ride from the first step you know, out there. Now, how important was it just for everybody just to try to stay as calm and composed and you know and just within themselves as, uh, as possible? Because you ladies did such a wonderful job of that. Yeah, we all just tried to remind each other that like we woke, we wake up every morning, we train for this, we go out when nobody else is up, and this it really paid off. So fantastic! Congratulations. Hi, I'm Ava Cole. Ava. I told uh, Coach Andrew, I, I'm just just massively Im impressed with just how you continue to get better every week, get better, you know, every uh, all, you know, with each training, with each race and whatnot. Like, and then to be able to amplify it, you know, in a field li uh, like tonight, like just uh, like how important is that not only for for you but this entire team uh, you know, uh, going going forward? That it's like yes, like. It, it is going to rise to the level of a, of a state field or a regional field or a national field. Like, how, you know, how, how reaffirming is that for you? I think the biggest thing is just making sure, like, I remind myself of the impact I have on our team. Like, if I can do good, I can push other people. And, like, that's what really makes us, like, a good team is that we really work together. And so a big part of this race is, like, once I found my teammates, like, really work together. And, like, I push them, they push me. And so I think that's what helps us compete at, like, those bigger levels. And that's what's helped us all, like, really progress this season especially so awesome don't yeah. ever let go of that plaque girl <laughs> uh, not even for the people in tsa <laughs> alexandra a fantastic job Thank uh, you. just uh, the the fact that you know it was such a test of patience last year you know it's such a test of perseverance for the whole group to finally you know come together you know obviously with nicole having to, you know, to wait for so long the fact that this group has been able to you know kind of really find its identity and you know and, and and find its union like right away this year like how, how uh, not just tonight but it, all the great results in Texas how important has it been that this has kind of been able to start from you know from from August and not waiting all the way till October or November um, I think it's very good to see we obviously like like Liana said we train really hard and we do workouts together we run together and I mean it's just like a whole team thing and I guess yeah we just want to be like great <laughs> The f uh, the fact that you know, so so many things have uh, you know kind of been a Murphy's Law situation for Flower Mound coming here you know in terms of you know not having the lineup that you want or you know you know posts getting in the way and you know I mean like just the the fact that everything clicked uh, tonight like uh, how meaningful is this for the group now and going forward? I think it's very like meaningful for us because I feel like this is like one of the first years like or one of the first races that I felt like we were all like very happy to come here. Like no one was, 
extremely nervous out there breaking down like everyone came here to run a good race and to work hard. Fantastic. Great job. Hi, I'm Adeline Bennett. Yet another of uh, the most underappreciated, underrated women, not just in Texas, but the United States. And she proved it again tonight. Like just uh, how, how full is your heart right now that you get to share this moment with these these six women and, and just you know kind of remind each other that it's like, hey, like we're just scratching the surface of how good this team can be. Yeah, I mean, I, I love it so much. I love the sport and I love my teammates. I think we're all really close and I think that helps a lot. And I think just like the fact that we're all really excited to get out here and run just like helps us perform so much better. Because when you have a teammate on the line that's crying, that doesn't help you race. But when you have someone that's smiling, it does. So I just like to keep that in mind. Well, all smiles tonight. Yeah. When you think back to coming here for the first time and, and then like just what it means you know, to see this come to fruition uh, tonight with that giant orange sphere in the, yeah. in the background, like just, you know, uh, how special is it that you're able uh, to be part of that journey with these women? I mean, it's amazing. Like last year, this time I watched them race and I thought, wow, that'd be amazing if I could like be here. And this year I am here and I'm just so happy with how we all performed, how I individually performed. So yeah, I'm really excited Great for the job. rest of the season. Congratulations. Thank you. And last but certainly not least. Hi, I'm Eliana Rivera. Eliana, uh, just the, uh, the, the depth is just, you know just so remarkable right uh, just how how exciting is it uh, it's like it doesn't matter you know uh you know, who, who graduates it's just like uh, that it's you know it, uh, someone's always gonna have a new opportunity to step up someone's always gonna have an opportunity to be a great friend a great teammate you know and maybe on nights like tonight i see seven heroes in front of me like just that you know how how awesome is it that everybody's gonna have their moment and it's like if everybody takes advantage of the moment we get history like tonight it's really amazing because I feel like, yes, we had some seniors graduate, but a lot of people stepped up and we have a really strong team. And like they said, we're really close and we work really hard. So no matter what, I think we're always going to be like really good. And yeah. Awesome. Uh, can't wait to see them uh, take it back home and get, uh, get the respect and the recognition that they deserve. But they are far from done. Uh, ladies, stay healthy. Congratulations. Well deserved. Thank you. <laughs>